rest of the week. We're definitely going to see more clouds today. Some spotty rain showers along the southern border. Less than a tenth of an inch. It looks pretty light after 4 p.m. We'll be staying in the 70s, which is slightly below average for this time of the year. Today we'll be in the lower 70s, and then the sunshine kicks in on Thursday and Friday, and it will be getting warmer. It looks nice most of Saturday, but we do have a chance at some scattered storms, and I'll show you that in just a moment. When I say nice, I mean because of the temperatures. We're at 50 57 degrees right now. The dew points in the lower 50s and the winds are refreshing out of the northwest light at 7 and the winds will stay light throughout the day today. If you have some bike riding plans or anything that involves the wind, maybe a golf game, it should be rather enjoyable. 50 degrees this morning in Hampton. You can see Creston starting off around 54 this afternoon. Highs will struggle to get to that 70 degree mark across most of the state. Just a little bit warmer in eastern Iowa and that's where highs will be closer to the mid 70s close to 80 degrees tomorrow and that's where we should be in early June. These are all the clouds pouring in due to this very strong storm system to our south and some rain continues to skirt that far southeast corner. Heavy rain moving out of Missouri into Illinois. This red area is where we have flash flood warnings. In effect, a lot of rain fell there overnight. We'll continue to see more clouds as a result of that front to the south and that could trigger a little light rain around four o'clock. You can see in southern Iowa in between Creston and Lamoni moving to the east, Grinnell, Atumwa, Oskaloosa, Pella around 6 p.m., but drier conditions after 10 o'clock tonight, and that's when the clouds will start to break up. When you wake up at this time tomorrow, it will be sunny and beautiful, and it looks like it will stay that way right through Friday. Now, as we see more sunshine, it will be getting warmer, and then some more clouds build in Friday night, and there's a chance of rain in far northern Iowa, and that's where the best chance for rain exists early on Saturday, but unfortunately, it does look pretty unsettled, so I can't rule out scattered showers and isolated thunderstorms really on and off throughout the day, with some of the heaviest rain falling Saturday night, Sunday morning, and again, Sunday night and Monday morning, and that's associated with some cooler air that will be dominating our forecast next week. Today will be the coolest day of the week with a high of only 72. Again, mainly cloudy with that light northwest wind. Tonight, temperatures will fall to around 50 degrees. Those spotty light rain showers will be in southern Iowa, and then everyone else will see the clouds break up overnight. Tomorrow, sunny 77. It will be a smiler on Thursday and Friday. 78, lots of sunshine on Friday. More scattered showers and thunderstorms on Saturday. I have 77 on Sunday. It does look cooler with some isolated thunder showers early and late in the day. Another chance for rain exists on Monday and Tuesday and Tuesday will be our coolest day next week with highs back in the upper 60s. When you think of June, you think of temperatures getting warmer. We're going to start off the month on a cool note with highs in the 70s and more clouds, but I think that's a welcome change overall. It gets a nine for the weather rating on this hump day. Not bad.